Hi everybody, it's Adam Loving with your Facebook Connect and Google Friend Connect Smackdown. Um, they both launched their services today and you may be um, faced with a decision about which to use when adding social, social features to your website. So I thought I'd do a quick rundown. Um, this is Google Friend Connect running on a blog. You can do much deeper integrations than this, but it gives you give you the flavor of it. So um, effectively, uh, I can sign in using my Google credentials, uh, and then uh, you know invite friends, participate in comments, uh, do all those kind of social things using my Google account. Um, this is the Facebook implementation running on a WordPress WordPress blog. Oops. It looks very similar. Uh, you can actually do much more integration than what's demonstrated here. Um, I'm actually logging into Facebook here. Um, but you see you get the basics of okay now this blog knows that it's me uh, here are the other people that have visited, and uh, you might find this entertaining. So now I can invite my friends to this blog, which uh, may make you cringe or may make you smile, I'm not sure. Uh, so, uh, yeah, a uh, little difference between the two. The um, Google is a little bit more advanced in terms of you can drag and drop some scripts into your site and get uh, more functionality quicker, but it's a, uh, a little bit buggier from what I've read. Um, Facebook Connect is really, in my opinion, just a rebranding of Facebook app um, capabilities that we've had for a long time and smoothing out the sign-in process. Um, but really, you could have faked this um, using all the Facebook APIs that have been around for the last year and a half or so. Um, so really, the question is why why would you do this? One, it makes it easier for your users to sign in. Um, it gives you, whichever service you use, it's going to give you a lot uh, more granular access to their profile data without them ever having you know, entered, entered it on your site necessarily. They just approved that your site has access to it. So you can imagine there'll be um, web analytics tools coming along that you know, let you track exactly who visits your site, how often, and their gender and age and all of that. Um, it potentially makes your site more viral, right, with these invite features. Rather than a share this button, you'll have an invite your friends button that could, you know, share any product or post or thing on your website. Um, and then additionally, there'll be lots of uh, developer tools that come out that allow you to supplement your existing website with social features like um, questions, comments, uh ratings, that kind of thing, uh, with pre-built code either from Facebook, Google, or uh, third-party developers that are just deploying code that sits in the middle. Um, so yeah, that's a quick look at Facebook Connect and Google Friend Connect. Um, I think they're pretty exciting services because of the, the ramifications of this, right? Uh, if either one of these guys wins, then they will, uh, you know, have the potential to have the user information for people as they surf the internet. So check it out. Thank you very much for watching. My name again is Adam Loving, and please check out my blog, pagerush.com, for social media SEO tools and tips. And I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.